Oh, what's up everybody? Once again, it's Brand Man Sean on a Friday, which means I'm going over some music resource or tool, maybe even a strategy. And today, I guess you can call it a strategy, but I'm answering a question from Swerve Innocent. He asked me, yo, Brand Man, how do you get to open for other artists? Now, I want to say that DJ MPTV answered it pretty well in the comments himself, but I figured that everybody could benefit from this answer, so I put it in a video. Now, number one, you could obviously just create direct relationships with the artist or their team in some form of fashion. If somebody on your team has a relationship with the manager, the graphic designer, or whoever is in that artist camp or the artist themselves, then there's a lot of situations where people have gone on tours off of direct relationships, but now that's probably not your situation. So let's get into some other solutions that you can create for yourself. One, if you can get a relationship with a promoter or a venue, oftentimes they can go hand in hand because venues oftentimes have their own promoters, then you can have a lot of opportunities open up for you to become an opening act for artists that come in town because these promoters and venues are always booking artists and they need opening acts. However, promoters need people as well. So you're not just going to be able to slide in in a lot of situations unless there's some kind of personal relationship that they say, hey, I'm just gonna put you in because there's a lot of strength in this relationship. Most times when you're reaching out, you're not gonna know these people. The best thing you can do is start small. Say, hey man, how many venues do you have? Some of these people have multiple venues and show them proof of concept. If you can book out a 50 person venue, then put, book out a 100 person venue, 200, 300, and just prove to them and let them see that progress, then oftentimes now they've seen that proof, they know that you can get people to come, so then they'll book you when they have these opening acts because they know that you can bring extra bodies. Because once again, yes, they need opening acts, but more than that, they need people. Promoters get paid to bring in people. So yes, you can reach out directly to these venues, you can reach out directly to these promoters, but at the end of the day, you need to figure out a way to prove to them that you can bring out people. And the better you do that, whether that's just your own shows at the venues or even inviting them out to other places and spaces, that's going to help you establish some kind of rapport where they know that they can rely on you when they need to book out a venue and they have this artist and they're trying to make sure they hit their numbers and they can profit off of you. You don't just want to be somebody that they like and they believe in. You want to be a good business decision for the promoter as well. Now, there's a third option. First, remember, direct relationship with the artist or camp in some form of fashion. The second one is developing a relationship with a venue or a promoter and then showing them, you know, however you do that, that you can bring out that so they can have confidence to bring you out and open for other acts. And then the third route is putting on your own show, paying for an artist to come in, you promote it yourself and then putting yourself in a position as an opening act. People do it all the time. A lot of these artists that you see that are opening for a lot of big artists a lot of times have some sort of team behind them, oftentimes likely promoters of some fashion. They pay for the show. They say, yo, I'm gonna bring 2 chains in town. They promote it as 2 chain show and then they just put themselves in an opening slot. And then they might even charge other people, other artists to perform in an opening slot, which is a fourth bonus way that you can become an opener, just pay for it. So if any of you guys happen to have some extra cash on you, then hey, go out, pursue an artist, pay them whatever their fee is, book a venue, do all the marketing and bring people in, and then slide yourself on in there as an opening act. That's a great way where if you know what you're doing, you can become an opener for a big artist, get that look, quote unquote, but also get a profit if you know what you're doing to make that money back from the show itself. Those are three ways, but actually a bonus fourth way, of course, as I mentioned. So that's three ways with the bonus fourth way that you can become an opening act for some of these bigger artists and names out there. If you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you like it, you might as well share it, especially if you know somebody who can use this information. But if you're not subscribed, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button.